Today at the Gym for Your Skin, my guest is one of the greatest Canadian rock stars. Follow me. He just got a laser treatment, we're gonna surprise him. Hey, Jonas, how are you? Hi, I'm Marilyn, I'm great, how are you? How was your treatment? It was great, it was quick, it was painless, and uh, Dr. Lan is very sweet. Yeah, she's uh, one of the sweetest on our team. Yeah. So, you were about concerned about your rosacea, right? Yeah, I was concerned about my rosacea. It came up about a year ago, mm -hmm. um, maybe a year and a half ago. Uh, I was noticing it more when I was coming off stage. I was noticing it when I was finished workouts. Um, I noticed it also if I was coming in from the sun, if I was out on the beach. Um, and if you have a drink. And if I have a drink, you know, if, <laughs> and, and that happens sometimes too. So with all of those things that I like to do, um, having this uh, constant reoccurrence um, was starting to become bothersome. Um, I, I spend a lot of time in front of the camera um, on stage, so I'm in front of a lot of people's cameras on mm -hmm. their phones. Um, and I kept noticing it, uh, it come up, you know, all, all the time in pictures. So. You didn't know you could treat that. I didn't know I could treat it. I went and I, I asked uh, around. I'd asked a couple of friends who uh, I, I saw had it as well. Um, I went to uh, a local dermatologist and uh, she told me that there was not much I could do for it. She said, Probably she had no laser. She had no laser, mm -hmm. clearly. She didn't have the technology that you have here. She didn't have, um, obviously, the, the wherewithal and the knowledge. Um, and so I kept asking because like I'm persistent, the yes. issue was persistent as well. <laughs> so I kept asking and uh, I was in a makeup chair uh, several weeks ago with a common friend, uh, yes. Mike Sade, and we were talking with the makeup artist and the makeup artist said uh, this is something that they see a lot. Clearly a lot of people um, you know, suffer from rosacea, if you like to call it suffering from it, but you know, a lot of people have the condition. And um, so Marie Sade said, I think I know somebody who can take care of you. Ah, that's you know, sweet. And, uh, that's <laughs> Good, so it went well. You didn't suffer too much. Not much at all, no. It was, it was <laughs> much quicker than I thought, too. The whole process, really, for half of my face was maybe 10 to 15 minutes. Great. And we're going to see you probably uh, two, three times extra. Okay. Space by a month, just okay. to make sure your, your skin heals properly in between treatments. Yeah. And uh, we're good to go. Actually, it's Friday. It's Friday. Let's do a little happy hour. A little sink set. A sink set. All right. Come on. Oh, nice shot. We've got some options. All over. <laughs> so, Jonas, you're always on stage. Uh, you go to sleep late, uh, you know, some makeup on. Yeah. How you deal with beauty? Like, do you have any routine? Yeah, there's a, there's a lot of things, um, you know, that you got to fight when you're touring. The lack of sleep. Waking up early, um, you know, the the diet too, all of those things um, that kind of come into play um, that you got to balance out. And I think uh, drinking lots of water, trying to, you know, eat well when you can eat well, and um, products, good products, uh, good skin creams, good, you know, so you face clean wash. Your face. You got to wash your face. Well, yeah, especially, you know, you're shaking a hundred. <laughs> hands a, a minute, you know, at the end yes. of a show, and uh, you're sweating on stage, and you're sleeping in different hotel beds every day. I mean, to have a little routine, at least something to be able to call your own, too. Yes. It's not just about um, taking care of necessarily the outside, but taking care of the inside. Having a little bit of routine in this world, in this life that doesn't have a lot of routine, um, is a little therapeutic, too. Nice, and we would believe, you know, most of the men, they don't want to talk about it, and. I think more and more like young men like you yeah. take care of themselves. So you also at home you also train and eat well. Yeah, I have a pretty um, you know I have a pretty good health routine. I've got a lot of yoga in my life. I train mm. uh, a couple times a week. I go to yoga a few times a week. I uh, I eat well when I'm not on the road. I eat well on the road, but mostly when I'm not on the road. Um, and all of that's mixed, you know, also with some fun. I mean, I like to have a good glass of wine. And I like to, uh, you know, eat uh, fun big meals, but everything in balance. And I think that taking care of yourself is part of that balance too. It's always about balance. Yes, it so, is. So um, yes, and I think we share a common passion. I heard that we do too. <laughs> you play music, right? A little bit, a little bit. You want to jam? Don't stop breathing. Pain is just a feeling. Make it one more reason 
why your heart is beating on the outside On the outside Don't stop breathing, pain is just a feeling Make it one more reason why your heart is beating on the outside Yeah, yeah, outside Ha, ha, ha.